Water is key to human survival, and to ensure that you're drinking enough water, what should you do? Carry around a water bottle. But while everyone and their best friend, their mom, their grandma, all have hydro flasks, you can't afford one. But that's okay because you don't need to. Today, at 3411 Heaven Media, we are reviewing the Super Sparrow. Stainless steel, vacuum sealed, water bottle for travel, the gym, office, whatever you need that retails for less than 20 bucks. Now before I go any further, I have to tell you something, and that is that we're doing a giveaway. Super Sparrow has been nice enough to provide us how many water bottles? Well, there's two, three, four, five. If you take these water bottles and you look closely, you look closely at the 3411 Heaven logo, we see that if we go like this, We see that you get all the colors of the 3411 Heaven rainbow. And because of that, yes, we are giving these away. To do that, all you have to do, make sure that you comment down below what color you want. But I encourage you to watch the rest of the video to ensure that your color is not destroyed. Yes, this video in the future, future me, will be using a hacksaw, a car, high levels of altitude, and other means to give these water bottles the test that they deserve. If you don't end up winning, it's not the worst thing in the world because you can buy these through the link in the description below. Comment what color you like, make sure that you're subscribed, and also go check out Super Sparrow on Instagram. Link will be below as well. And then, yes, you will be entered to win these water bottles. We will announce the winner at a future date, which will be listed somewhere down here. The water bottles themselves, though, like I said, they range anywhere in price from $13 and some cents, all the way up to $17 and some cents, which is significantly cheaper than a hydro flask. From what I can tell, they are pretty dang good quality. Super Sparrow, cool logo. I mean, Super Sparrow, it's a super bird. What more can you ask for? One thing that I'd like to note right away though, that really sets these guys apart. I don't know how much this rubber thing on the bottom would cost if you had to buy it, like, you know, for your hydro flask, but they include that in the packaging because this area on the 750 milliliter bottle is easily dented. I've seen it dented by almost everyone. Just think, you're walking along, you got your water bottle, you drop it on the ground, boom, it's dented. And then what happens? Your water bottle automatically falls over every time you use it. But if you have this rubber thing on the bottom, not only is it less susceptible to denting, it'll also keep it upright in the event that you do dent it in the future. The water bottles themselves, if you look inside, there's a silica gel packet, which you wanna make sure well, these are fairly difficult to get out. Silica gel packet that you wanna make sure that you take out and that you wash the bottle before drinking it. Some other features are this is BPA and toxin free, comfortable grip, sweat proof finish, this paint. That's what they're talking about. I mean, I sweat a lot when I'm in the gym. Believe it or not, I do actually work out on a semi-regular basis. <laughs> uh, if your hand's sweaty, it's not gonna slip because this has built in grip to the paint. This one is 750 milliliters and a weight of 360 grams. I don't know if it really matters how much your water bottle weighs to you. You know, quarantine, if you want this thing as a dumbbell, you can fill it up with water and use it as a weight. Vacuum seal is in part due to the seal that goes around the lid here. And they are nice enough to include an extra one with your water bottle. There, to replace it in case it gets lost when you're washing it. This little band, uh. I really don't know what it's quite for, but you can slip it on over. Oh, oh, okay. Okay, I should have really read the directions. This band, if you take the knife, <gasps> I was right. So if for some reason you accidentally, you can interchange this band. That is so cool. Customizable. Long story short, these water bottles come in three sizes, 750 milliliters, 500 milliliters, and 250 milliliters. The smallest one being this. This is kind of a fun in, in the insulated case that it has. It's kind of cool. It's a little baby water bottle. If you don't see the color that you like on this table, there are in total 16, so be sure to check out their other color offerings. But now, it's time for me to go a wild with these things. You'll want to stick around for this. I'll see you out in the field. One of these water bottles will ultimately be injured 
and we'll see which one gets chosen. Don't forget to enter the giveaway. So right now I'm on my second story balcony and anything with the name Sparrow in it obviously means that it can fly. So what are we gonna do to first test out this water bottle and its durability? Well, we're gonna chuck it off the balcony. So for this first drop, it's gonna be the oops, I tipped it off the rail drop because obviously after someone tells you a funny joke, you just... Well, so, so far it has survived unscathed. Yeah, it's uh, it's doing quite well. It's got water in it, so it's full. Um, this is called the failed water bottle flip into a tree. Oh. Okay, so just some small scuffing that came from this one, but honestly it's just dirt, so it's really just dirty. I think it damaged more of the tree than it actually did the water bottle. So last but not least, we do the, the torpedo, where I'm going to flip it up and hopefully it'll land on its head and exploit a weakness. After that, just a little bit of scuffing, no immediate damage to it, so on to the next thing. All right, so now obviously after throwing it off the deck a couple times, we haven't seen any damage. So what I'm gonna do next, because it's a logical next step, is run it over with my car. I'm gonna shove the water bottle right in front of that tire, drive over, hopefully nothing too dangerous. By the way, don't try this at home. All right, so I mean, at this point, we understand this thing is pretty durable, running it over, throwing it off stuff. And, but imagine, you know, you're walking into your house with a hammer and you just trip and like, you have to just, just you know. Yeah, it put a couple more dents So now that we've done some practical testing, like actually getting it run over by a car and chucking it off the balcony, we can do some other tests that may or may not be beneficial to you. Can this fit in a couple? I mean, before it being absolutely, you know, trounced by the car, I would say it would fit in a little easier than it is currently. What I really like is the slim profile of this bottle, or at least the slim profile that it once had, because it allows it to fit in cup holders fairly easily. Secondly, if you don't have a cup holder, can you set it on the ground? Will it tip over, even though it's all dented like this? Well, I'd say it speaks for itself. The Sparrow is holding up quite well. It is double walled. That's all I have for testing, considering I think this is shot. But if you won this one, man, you're gonna get something with a lot of character. So now that we've done totally unspeakable things to these water bottles, all I have to say is don't forget to drop a like on this video if you enjoyed it, and also to check out Super Sparrow on Instagram, and make sure that you enter the giveaway by commenting, making sure you're subscribed. As always, folks, we'll catch you in the next one. If you want us to do other videos like this in the future, please, please let us know. Bird up.